department officials are here to listen to you. I'm a sixth generation on this farm. We homesteaded during the Kincaid Act. Been a long time living there. That's our livelihood. Nebraska Farmers Union urges President Obama and Secretary Kerry to protect our nation's primary economic and environmental interests and deny the permit for the Keystone XL pipeline. And I'm here today as a voice and testament for what has happened to my community in Mayflower, Arkansas. I came all the way from North Carolina to be here. Join us and say no to KSL. The perception of moving away from fossil fuels appears to be large and daunting, but we undoubtedly have the ability, the intelligence, and the energy to meet this challenge. I hope I Thank you. Speaker number 127. This is not about politics. This is about what is right for humanity. Our children, yours and mine, Mr. President, will curse us in 25 to 50 years. Question is, is he going to raise the heavy hand of big oil, or is he going to raise the hand and the spirits of the American people? When your bulldozers try to cross our line, every single person will be here saying no. Not in our land, not in our water, not in our country. Thank you.